one mistake I want to start with, uh, you might wonder why I'm saying that, but uh, in many cases, uh, people are, when they're going for a tortuous bone, they go uh, right away for a second donor site, but in many cases, this is not needed. So instead, you can just go for, for example, in this case, a trephine, just try to think autogenous, as my good friend uh, Ur Merit from Istanbul always likes to say, uh, just think, where can I collect bone? And uh, if you have this mindset, you will find a lot of that and can, of course, save a lot of money uh, instead of um, yeah, spending it for substitutes, which are only osteoconductive. You see here, we can fix these uh, bone cores just with the head of the screw. Or also, this is another case where we build some bone vertically. And uh, yeah, then um, you see here some bone needed to be re-augmented in um, the palatal area. But instead of going for another block and uh, open again the external oblique line, we can just easily go, for example, to the tuberosity, get some bone from there and use it. Uh, recently in the social media, I, I saw a nice expression. It was called the Robin Hood technique. So taking from the rich side and give it to the poor side. So this is something always keep in the head. And you can even reuse the screws as you see it here. And we have now the, the, the implant surrounded with a lot of torchness bone. So try to think autogenous. And sometimes a second donor site is really not needed to keep it a minimal invasive. 